fellow pop collectors and Dragon Ball Z fans. Today I'm going to be showing you and opening some of the Dragon Ball Z pop, uh, Funko Pop figures from their new collection that just got released. So uh, I've actually never opened up a set. I'm going to take this off the scouter because I can tell you power level is not over 9,000. But uh, never opened up a full set before. I have all my uh, figures still sealed in the box for now. But uh, right now, the Dragon Ball Z set, it's a set that no matter what happens, I want, you know, I grew up loving Dragon Ball Z, so if I open them, I'm never, I would never sell them anyway, so I'm going to keep them, keep the boxes in good condition, but open up the figures and kind of just have them on my desk, kind of, I think it'd be kind of cool. So I'm going to open up each one of these, uh, besides the Hot Topic exclusive Goku, only because it's not much different than the Super Saiyan Goku, and since it's a Hot Topic exclusive, I'll just keep this one sealed. I also do not have Piccolo. Uh, for some reason, all the Hot Topics that I've been getting all these, which have been selling out extremely fast of these, it was a real hard time getting all these. I had to get them for two different Hot Topics. But uh, they used to the only Piccolo yet for some odd reason, which, I mean, for me, Piccolo was, was my least favorite from the set. I would have preferred him, it to be Gohan instead of Piccolo, but Piccolo was still a badass. But it was, out of all six from the set, he was my least favorite. So if they were not going to get one, and I'm happy it was Piccolo. But I don't have Piccolo yet. I don't know if I'm going to get it. I might get it. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to be opening up Super Saiyan Goku, Vegeta, Perfect Cell, and the Frieza Final Form. So let's get into it. Alright, so I'm going number order. First one in the set is actually the Hot Topic exclusive Goku, which I'm not going to be opening. The only difference between uh, this one and uh, Super Saiyan Goku is besides it being different numbered in the set, it's on the back even. If you look, you see Goku, regular. Uh, the only difference is the hair. This see, he's regular, not Super Saiyan. The other one, he's Super Saiyan. But this one's a little rare, so I'm gonna keep this one sealed. If I'm gonna keep any of them. So next, well, if you're gonna go in number order, first up for opening is Vegeta. So now, one thing I like about these figures is they're very simple to open. Bam. Cool thing about this set that I uh, haven't seen in any other sets yet is uh, the back of each box actually has a description of the character. Every box is a different description of the character, which is kind of cool. So Vegeta. So we got the Prince of Saiyans here. Put him up carefully. This thing's very cool about Vegeta. Besides me dropping him, sorry about that, Vegeta. So he has the Scouter. You can see, very cool. He's in his Saiyan armor from the beginning of the series when he first made his appearance. Uh, he still has his tail, well, wrapped around at least. You know, it's very slight. You can see the tail there in the back, which is actually very cool. Uh, the Saiyan armor is highly detailed. You know, it looks just like it does in the show. It's beautiful. He has his arms crossed, just like he does. You know, when he's standing off against Goku. Very, very cool. Hair is very well detailed. It looks very nice in the back and in the front. A very nice figure, very nice indeed. So yeah, that's Vegeta. This over here. The next number in the set, that was number 10. Number 11 is Piccolo, which I do not have, so it's going to number 12. Number 12 is Final Form Frieza. Now I'm really hoping they do a second set of Dragon Ball Z figures, you know, maybe uh, Majin Buu included with that one. And they do Gohan, I'd say Krillin, but no one will buy Krillin. So it's like Frieza. The box right here, you know, same thing you see on the back. You know, it's kind of hard to see the camera. We'll make sure it's in, the, in focus, but it's on a tripod so it's hard to tell. But you can see right there, you know, it has its own picture of Frieza in the description. And now Frieza, you know, just as you would expect a Frieza figure to look like, you know, nicely detailed body, uh, the back has its tail, you know, not really much to it, but there's not really much to Frieza's design in general, you know, looks like, I feel like Frieza and Mewtwo would be really cool together, but, uh, yeah, you know, there's Frieza. Boom. Alright. Next in the set. 
perfect form Cell. Cell is always one of my favorite sagas of the whole series. You know, don't get me wrong, I loved all of them, all the whole show. But I don't know. I, mean, I have all three of the main bad guys of Z at least, considering uh, consider uh, Frieza, Cell, and Majin Buu. I mean, I, th I thought Cell was the most well uh, designed, personally at least. If you don't agree with me, leave me a comment uh, below. Let's talk about it. Uh, so yeah, Cell's figure is very, very nice. Ooh, I love this one already. But, you know, the black just shines, just like, you know, Cell did in the show. Uh, the back, he has his little tail, if you can see it right there. The wings are very well done with the purple. Uh, you know, very nice figure indeed. On top of the head. You know, I could, I could ask nothing more for a Cell figure than this right here. This is very nice, very well detailed. I'm very excited to have this one in my collection. So, yeah. Cell. And last, but certainly not least, the hero of the universe, number 14, Super Saiyan Goku. Now, if I was going to get one from this set, it was going to be Goku, but I got them all, besides Piccolo. You know, it's cool because the description they have in the back is actually a description talking about Planet Namek from the first time Goku went Super Saiyan in the fight with uh, Frieza. So it's kind of cool. Boom. Look at that. These figures are so beautiful right here. Goku's, oh, it's head, it's head even pivots. That's kind of really cool. I, didn't, I don't know if all these figures do that. I've never really opened them, so I wouldn't really know. But that's kind of really cool. You know, the back doesn't have the symbol that he has for most of the show. But, you know, depending on what era this is out of, it's acceptable. But, uh, yeah, not very well detailed. The eyes are green, which I love since, you know, usually they're either white or black for a Funko figure. But the eyes are green, just like Super Saiyan. Uh, the hair is awesome. Very well done. You know, everything about it is just awesome. This whole set, flawless. So I'm very happy with these figures, um, you know, so let me know which ones you guys have in the comments below, which ones you're going to pick up, which ones you're looking for, which ones you can't find, uh, which ones you really want, which ones you're begging your parents to buy you, anything. Just let me know what you think of these guys, you know, I'm extremely happy with these figures, you know. Uh, let me know, also, let me know how you feel about Hot Topic Goku, are you going to get both? Like I did, you can get the regular and the Super Saiyans, you can get one or the other. You know, let me know what you're doing with that one. So let me know in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.